For me, the paintbrush has been the tool, my weapon, and my lifeline. It was here at Phoenix College while taking art classes that I discovered my painting. It was here that I found a rich and fertile environment that nurtured my creative exploration, applauded my discovery, gave me confidence and self-esteem. Above all, being here made me feel connected to myself and to others, to my community, my time, and the history we all share. And when you look at the arts, that creative discipline is what uh, comes together in someone's mind, puts it on paper or sculpture or whatever medium that they choose. And uh, you start taking a look at the world through another set of eyes. Ten years ago, I established the Vanguard Award here at the college because I reached a point in my life where, through my success, I was able to give back. My objectives with the Vanguard Award were to try to identify uh, the, the sort of young talent, uh, so the, the sort of the beginnings of, of something that could really grow and prosper. Hearing that I had won the Vanguard Award and that um, I was going to meet Eric and get to participate in this amazing process just kind of renewed all of my inspiration and breathed new life into the work that I was doing. It was validation, you know, for the first time in my life that you make art and, and um, you are an artist. It definitely catapulted me to seek more, to learn more. I wanted to connect it to the uh, art community that exists within the valley which is a very vibrant uh, one, and I, I wanted to contextualize it, so we connected it to the Phoenix Art Museum. It's really important to help build that community of artisans who can contribute to their community uh, as they go out into the world of work. Most people really wouldn't look at an economic impact of the arts, but when you think about it, those artistic achievements are what make us stand back and look at ourselves. We have many um, examples of students who were not thinking that they would continue to pursue a Bachelor of Fine Arts degree who have gone on to, uh, to do that. We've seen artists who have achieved a, a level of skill from their experience here that they're now uh, exhibiting in, in art galleries in the valley. Talking with Eric and he said, you know, I said, you know, I'm kind of thinking about, you know, taking my stuff up to a gallery. And he was like, why didn't you do this before? You should have done this a long time ago. So I think it was an extra push to say, you know, Go ahead, do it now. When I received my Vanguard Award, I felt like my work was validated. Therefore, I was able to like go up to gallery people. From there, I was able to uh, get a show at the Art Pella Gallery. I could enter a show in Georgia that I could afford to ship my pieces off to. We've seen uh, uh, students who have taken their art uh, talents and applied them to social and community programs. I, I feel like it's a responsibility to give back if you have the knowledge and you have the resources. When you look at the school, what it's really about is the students. And if you can get involved and help those students, uh, you can't help but get motivated and be part of the school. Getting out of high school, like I had to figure out how to get into college but without having documentation. At the time I got the scholarship, I was working at an auto body shop and without the scholarship, I think I would probably still wor be working at an auto body shop. The Vanguard Award helped me by um, giving me this much needed money. I mean, I was totally broke and I was just struggling to make my way through school. Young artists are our future like every other discipline. We may not look at it that way, but when you think about our future, our future is really gonna be based on innovation. And innovation and creative discipline in any uh, field that you choose is important. In 10 years, I would like to have an MFA and be teaching. My plans are now certainly including art and including doing it the rest of my life. It was just kind of the door opening, I think, of, of my art career and my life. We have many aspiring artists who are very talented and creative, and they need financial support to continue their education. We can support the youth by guiding them, by supporting their art. 
by providing space like this to create change and to create positive artwork that will impact future generations. I think people should invest in certainly the education of young artists. As a bonus, they should invest in the work of young artists because it may turn out that one or more of those young artists go on to be the next Picasso or Rembrandt.